So we've just done a presentation for Ollie Kids at this amazing school. And it was emotional and yes, I lost it. But why I really lost it was because of this lovely lady. She said, you know, introduce yourself and would you be kind enough to... Just say what you said and make me lose it. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm Amy Darby. I'm the, one of the assistant heads at All Saints Primary School. I'm also the DSL and SENCO. Um, do you want me to explain the programmes that have been going on in school? What, we have, what you thought of the school? So, yeah. yeah, we were put on to um, Ali and I went to, attended a meeting over at Kings Hill Primary yeah. School in Warsaw and came back, shared it with our SLT and it was something we felt a lot of our children um, through a variety of reasons, through changes over the COVID period but also changes in local society and local, our local community. We've got a lot of families that are, are finding life tricky and some of the things that are missing for those families and our, their children are some of those emotional connections the children get it but they don't know how to let it out or how to deal with it which was why everything you spoke to me about at that first meeting hit and resonated so well so we've worked with our year ones and twos using a class-based program which i know um you had your own concerns about when it first started we, we didn't know if we could do it but we did but that you did and yeah. actually to see our children still now after two weeks holiday, which might sound really saft, but that, that's a lot for those littlies to remember and still be doing, to be catching the emotion and to squeeze it up, to talk into their emotion and noticing it in other children in the classroom and using those same strategies has really been beneficial. It was great that our teachers could go along to that and witness it as that's well. Really important you because you Because they it then kept yeah. it going and it testament to you as well some of those teachers have gone home and used it with their own children <laughs> and have been quite pleased with like going oh my goodness I never thought of doing it that way before so real plus point uh year sixes um we had we had quite a, a fractious start to our school year with our year sixes got some very very big characters in the year group but also those characters coming from a range of backgrounds with lots of things going on externally to school that they're dealing with in their own ways throwing transition hormones year yeah. six <laughs> high school choices they were finding things tricky yeah. and you've worked with um, 10 of our children and both the ollie kids program and i spoke to both ali and belinda before and shared that although they might not be vocal about what they've been doing their actions are speaking louder than the words because the numbers of incidents those children are involved in has decreased. Their manner in and around school, just with how they deal with themselves in that moment, you can clearly see what you've said to them, they've taken in and they've they realised and they're using. They might not be shouting about it, but the pride when having had those certificates now and they desperately want to put the t-shirts on and run outside and share it with everybody else shows for some of those characters that were very quiet, wouldn't have said boo to a goose or told you how they were feeling. For them to be able to feel confident to go out there and do that, I think that's testament to the progress they've made. And, and I have to say seriously, heartfelt thank you because I live to do this. I truly believe if we can get to the kids, then they won't be carrying the problems we are. And I've loved working them. Week one, they called themselves the Misfits. Well, they might be, but they're one hell of a team of them. Yeah. And we can do what we want. We can try our hardest. But if the school's not behind it, it doesn't work. And you and your staff, I mean, we've thrown them in, bless them. But seriously, I'm, I mean it. Thank you very much. No, thank it's you. Been we've been really, really grateful to know about this and hope to work with it going forward as well. That would be amazing. Cool.